Hi guys and welcome to Tech Anorak. So I thought I'd do something a bit different tonight. I, I couldn't be bothered going in my um, studio set up in my bedroom. So basically I nearly lost my 4A today. It nearly got smashed to pieces because my little daughter, bless her, she's um, a toddler. And um, we, we were driving into a car park and because it's been really hot in the UK, I had my back window down, just um, this one here, if you can see. And this is my daughter's child seat behind us. And I'll just light it up actually for you. Just light it up with a 4 8 itself. And um, so yeah, basically the, the air con in my um, Honda, I've got a little Honda Civic uh, 2012 plate. Um, but yeah, I've not had it very long. I didn't have it last summer. I got it in um, April. And um, yeah, the air con needs regassing. So I'll probably do it, you know, at some point. But yeah, basically I had to have the window open and my daughter has decided to throw my 4A out the window. And um, luckily it landed face down on the asphalt or tarmac as we call it in the UK. And it survived absolutely fine. Um, it's in its trusty speaking case. I'll just put it up to the light guys so this is a tough armor case you know with a kickstand you've, you've probably seen it on my channel um and this definitely saved my phone um i think the 4a is a tough little device anyway but there's no cracks on it or anything like nothing bad happened to it um you know I, it had that uh, moment you know when if you've ever dropped your phone and it's face down on the ground and you're like Ugh, and you pull it up but it was fine so, uh, you know, all good in the hood, but I was worried because I love this phone and it is insured, but I want this one. I don't want a replacement, you know, I, I started my channel with this. Um, but basically my daughter had it in her hands because she's um, a toddler and she gets, um, you know, really upset on car journeys. Um, so she was watching Peppa Pig, if you've ever seen that, if you're a parent or whatever. But um, yeah, basically, if she's got this phone in the car, I'm not putting the window down. I'll put the window in front of her down. But yeah, um, I'm not sponsored by Spigen, as I always say, guys. You know, I'll tell you if I'm ever sponsored by someone. But this case, I've got it on my iPhone 11 as well. And um, I've had it on multiple phones in the past. I highly, highly recommend this because it's um, got a rubber layer and a plastic layer. That's where your kickstand is. Um, but it it does really absorb impact. Um, the other thing I've got on my 4A is the Spigen um, Glass R um, tempered glass screen protector, and you get like a fitment um, tool with it. Again, I've probably you know shown you this on my channel, but um, that basically you can't get it wrong. You know it fits to the phone, but. Yeah, it does sound like I'm sponsored by Spigen, but I'm not. I'm just saying, just a little story, guys, because I've not done a video this week. I've been a bit busy, but I thought I'd tell you, you know, my 4A nearly died, and I'd be really sad, but this is a durable little phone, so I think definitely this case and the screen protector helped, but I think the 4A, you know, is a tough phone. Um, if she'd thrown my iPhone 11 out the back window, it's glass at the back, it's a glass sandwich, as they call it, I think that'd be dead now, you know, um, I'd be ringing the insurance company probably, or if the, if the screen wasn't cracked at the front, I probably wouldn't, you know, claim on the insurance and just have a crack back and get it fixed by somebody at some point. But yeah, um, like I say, guys, you know, if you're thinking of the 4A or any phone, get that case because I had um, a Rinky, uh, R-I-N-G-K-E, um, case on my old uh, Samsung um, Note 10 Lite. It's the Rinky Fusion and it looked like a tough case but it's just um, one layer so um, that phone when I dropped it on a, a stone floor it just died but again if I drop this on a stone floor I think it's five because um, I was going about only five miles an hour because I was just coming into a car park and she, I, she threw it out the window. My wife was in the back and my son was in the front. And um, my wife said, I think your phone's just been thrown out the window. And I was like, 
no, she will have thrown it down the side of the car, like the back here. And um, no, she'd, she'd thrown it down um, out the window. So yeah, there you go, guys. 4A survives to live another day. Love this phone, you know, like I say. Um, I'm a bit sad when the 5A comes out because this will be like the older one, but I'm keeping this. I've, like I said in some comments recently, if you've seen it, like I'm going to hand it down to my grandchildren. You know, when you've got like a chip in your brain and you don't need a phone anymore, this is going to my grandkids. Anyway, guys, just to like I say, different one for you. Just thought I'd give you, um, you know, a little review on the 4A's durability and, you know, hit me up in the comments. Tell me if you've had any near misses with your phones. It doesn't have to be the 4A, but if it is the 4A and you've, you know, dropped it off a building or a roller coaster or something, <laughs> you know, whatever. Tell me, guys. Anyway, hit me up. Take care. Thanks. Take on a rack out. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys.